My belief is that morally God and Satan are vaguely on the same page. According to the common understanding of Satan's origin, holiness is metaphorically frozen stiff in his veins, and at that, a corrupted formula, i.e. legalism. The vital difference is that God is willing to offer grace for our sins. He delights in grace. God is the one and only holy and just punisher of sin. Yes, but that is partly so because punishment, for the sake of punishment, is not something he loves. Where, where he is, Satan, whereas Satan, as the accuser, and as it is written, actually seeks God's permission to punish. He, being a seasoned legalist, delights in finding wrongs and will defy his own morta morality just to expose immorality. This is why both the anti-religious soul and the violently, violently religious soul are, whether consciously or unconsciously, and sadly enough, glorifying the, their biggest hater, Satan is not only a lawless lover of punishing lawlessness, but also the sharpest theolo theologian of us all. He loves wickedness, but not only, but only because he loves punishing wickedness.